Hey Chris, this is a video response to your outgoing tweet in which you hopefully get to shine a light on my channel. Before anything, I want to get to two points. The first one being, I have two channels that inspire me, which obviously is yours, Chris from Chris Cross Media. Your channels inspire me and Dodgers channel. And both of our channels, Press Hard to Continue and Dexterity Bonus. I watch your channel and her channel like every day. Actually, those are the only two channels that I believe that I watch religiously. So I want to just say thank you guys for inspiring me. The reason you guys inspired me was because at the time I was going through a really bad artist block. I couldn't paint and draw anything. I wasn't satisfied with anything that I put on canvas or paper. And I set out to look out for something inspirational. So I figured, why don't I just watch Zelda, since I like Zelda. And I came across your channel in which you were talking about Zelda for a while. And this was way before Skyward Sword. I've been sub to you for quite a while now. And that made me think, why can't I do that? I like Zelda. These guys like the same thing that I like. Makes me think, why can't I start my own channel? So I did. And before I actually put it, uploaded anything, I had some edited stuff, some stuff edited already, and then I figured now I need kind of the mental state. So I typed up in the search bar how to start your own YouTube channel and what to expect. And I came across Dodgers. And she said that, you know, just prepare yourself mentally, get ready for the onslaught of people commenting, whether good or bad. Just make sure that you use the bat to work to better your channel and to making it better. So I took both yours and her advice. And together, you guys made me start my own channel. So this is what my channel is all about. Painting. Drawing. I'm an artist and I like painting a lot. I paint constantly. This is my Totoro drawing, which I did not so long ago because I felt inspired to do Totoro. And if I'm not painting, I'm always drawing. So I'm always, I love drawing anything Disney characters, my own characters. I just like creating stuff out of my, like, I don't know. I, have my, I let my imagination just run wild on... on any piece of media that I get, whether canvas or just a white piece of paper. I also am a pin trader at Disneyland. I love pin trading. There's nothing more than pin trading for me. I love Disneyland, so every once in a while I'll talk about Disneyland and what pins that I get. I'm pretty sure you can recall somebody with this hat running up to you and going, Hey Chris! And they're shaking your hands and talking to you and just chatting for a little while. But um, thanks for stopping and saying hi, man. You're definitely so down to earth. So that's what I like about your channel. What I do mainly on my channel here is just showcase my artwork. And I would really love to show other people's artwork. I've shown some of my cousin's artwork. She just does incredible work. Um, if you guys really want to check it in any of my artwork, I normally typically just vlog for a while. Talk about what I did and what inspired me to do this certain painting. I get more into the painting. And then at the end, I show the painting. And you guys just get... To look at it for a little while I guess for a couple minutes and that uh, if I, and sometimes I've done uh, how to draw Jack Skellington which is my favorite they also inspired me how um, to, to start drawing as a kid I remember I saw the night before the nightmare before Christmas for the first time and I was just blown away I thought I had invented stop-motion animation as a child because my parents bought me this camera when I was a kid and I would want and I would put my Pokemon toys and make them battle louder and I would do the voices and the background drawings and everything I would just go all out on it and I love doing that. So now that I have an actual YouTube channel, I could do it further and hopefully have other people give me feedback on it. And as opposed to back then as a child, I just would watch it for my own enjoyment and now I could share my artwork with other people and hopefully they could share some of theirs with me. I also think it's pretty incredible how you have time for your fans. Every time I tweet you or ask you a question in any social media, you respond right away. You've never not answered one question. I don't know how you could keep up with everyone. I don't know if you just do that specifically because I ask certain things or if you do that to everybody. That is pretty incredible, Chris. That's pretty awesome. So thank you for doing that. On behalf of every Chris Cross Maniac out there, I'm pretty sure we all appreciate the fact that you get the time out of your busy schedule day, I'm pretty sure, to say hi or just to answer or wish someone a happy birthday, which I've seen you done. And I think that's pretty awesome. So to sum it all up, I'm really more of a a vloggy type of person my channel will mainly just showcase my artwork at the end but it'll also talk about that specific painting or or piece of artwork that i did i'll also talk about disney stuff which i am a big disney fan i'll also talk about movies every once in a while i might do a skit who knows um my cousin will come along every once in a while and we'll just chat and be crazy like we are in you in our normal day to day lives Hopefully you get lots of responses from your faithful crisscross maniacs and 
I'm trying to make this short because I'm pretty sure you have your work cut out for you with so many responses. And even if you don't put the spotlight on me, I'm so grateful to you because, like I said, you you inspired me along with Dodger, and you're sub to me. So there, enough said. That just like blows my mind. It's just like completely out of, I don't know. But thanks again, and hopefully your channel grows. I will be one of those people who will contribute to your growth in your channel. I will always be commenting. I will always be looking to see what new things you have, what new month you're coming up with. So thank you, Chris, everyone. Stay tuned to his channel and hopefully my channel. And like I always say, stay safe out there and take care.